The problem also with socialized healthcare and the so-called public option would lead us to that logically uh, is that it's very difficult to get rid of it because if you consider that healthcare is a right then and should be provided for free then people wouldn't take care of themselves as much as look I mean in all countries with socialized healthcare you can see people abusing uh, their health, uh, the amount of people smoking, drinking, uh, being engaged in risky behavior is, is overwhelming. So it's very difficult to, to reform, to, to make reforms to get back of it. Right now many countries in Europe, including Sweden, which was considered to be kind of like a showcase for, for socialism, um, Sweden is trying to to reform its health care, to privatize uh, certain services. United Kingdom, uh, David Cameron's government, is, it's one of the goals. Um, in Canada, they, they right now are allowing private competition to government health care. And in the United States, it would be very difficult because if people would not already be saving, would not be thinking that they are responsible for it, uh, then, uh, then the, the to go back would be extremely difficult. Polish first president of the Free Poland, Lech Walesa, he used to say that it's easy to make a fish soup out of aquarium, but it's very difficult to make aquarium out of the fish soup. So it's, uh, it goes one way. In Soviet Union and other countries, uh, when they tried to reform it, 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 it proved to be extremely difficult. Then what? You, you throw patients out of the window because nobody saved enough to pay and and I think that healthcare is is too important for people to to to, to be engaged in risky experiments uh, with your own life with your own body